Hey guys, what's up? This is Trish. Welcome to my channel, Trish the Natural. You guys already know by the title what I'm doing today. I am reviewing products from Beyonce's new hair care line, Sacred. Guys, I am so excited. I was able to get these products early. I was waiting for them to drop. Now, I didn't get one of the big bundles, which, you know, probably deep down, that's what I wanted to get. But I decided, I said, well, let me start, you know, with a few of the products and see how I like them. If I really like them, I can always order more. So what I'm going to be reviewing today are three products from the hair care line, Sacred. Um, I'll be using the hydrating shampoo the moisturizing deep conditioner, and also the moisturizing sealing lotion. I'm going to use this as a styler. And uh, I'm going to let you guys know how I feel about it. Um, this is a line, you know, that Beyonce, um, you know, just dropped, as I said. And I saw an interview that her mom did uh, with Allure. So her mom, you know, was uh, also involved. And you guys know her mom is um, uh, her stylist. She has been a stylist for decades. She has a wealth of knowledge about hair. So, you know, what, <laughs> what a great combination, right? And they were really serious, you know, about these products, the formulation, the testing, the ingredients. And this was all according, you know, to the interview that her mom did with Allure. Look again, I am so excited. So guys, let me get started. What I'm gonna do first, I'm gonna shampoo my hair and I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna let you guys know what I think about the shampoo. And then after that, I'm gonna apply the deep conditioner, let you guys know, you know, how it feels, you know, how's the scent and all that. And then after I apply the deep conditioner throughout my hair, I'm gonna sit in the dryer uh, for 30 minutes. You guys know I like to let it marinate. And then after that, I'll come back and I'll rinse that out. And then I'll come back and I'll apply um, the hydrating sealing lotion to set my twist out or whatever style I'm going to do. So with that, guys, getting ready to go shampoo. Keep watching. Okay, guys, I am back. I have finished shampooing my hair. I, I left this side down because I wanted you guys to see what it looks like. You guys know I like to twist my hair up and organize it, you know, so I don't have so many tangles. But I did leave this down, and I can just, like, really feel my texture. This shampoo, guys, I like it. I like it. And um, it says uh, uh, gently cleanses while adding moisture and slip. And it did. Um, the uh, consistency is a, a really uh, cre not creamy, almost silky. I don't know. You know, just a real nice, smooth uh, texture you know to the shampoo and uh sorry guys i'm dripping everywhere but um a, a real a real smooth texture to it as so and you do not have to use a lot as soon as i i put it you know in my hand and as soon as i put it on my hair it started lathering up you do not have to work to make it lather and i had some gunk on my hair now i did you know because i had uh previously had a wash and go where i used mousse and i used gel so i i rinsed my hair i try to rinse my hair really well and um uh after rinsing my hair that's when i applied the shampoo it lathered right up it felt smooth it did feel moisturizing right now it feels moisturizing um too it does not feel dry or you know how your hair can you know they say squeaky squeaky clean like it it feels like it's definitely clean because like i said i had some gunk in it but um it definitely feels clean but it doesn't feel stripped that's what i'll say it does not feel stripped i am liking it uh and you can see you know the shine you know on my I'm like okay so okay all right, Beyonce. I am 
definitely liking the shampoo. And then, uh, like I said, upon contact, lather, lather. So a nice, smooth, you know, velvety like uh, lather. So I like, I like the shampoo. So what I'm getting ready to do next is to apply um, the moisturizing deep conditioner and it says apply generously to uh, section clean wet uh, hair and um, it says something about uh, you can add heat but no need to go past 30 minutes so that's fine that is fine and it does have a seal on the top. Now, let me tell you guys about the shampoo. Let's see. It, it's a, a light, a light scent. Mm, uh, just a, a, a light, pretty fragrance. A light, pretty fragrance. Maybe a like a pretty, uh, more uh, floral type perfumey smell but very light it's not overwhelming at all okay so the deep conditioner mm. Ooh, got a little thickness to it i like that i do like a thicker deep conditioner and it too it has a light fragrance a light soft fragrance not too overpowering I'm going to start with this much, and I'm going to put it through my hair. I'm not going to try to do a lot of detangling upon initial application. I'm going to uh, sit under the dryer, like I mentioned earlier, and, you know, put some heat to it, let it marinate, and then I'll probably do some detangling at that point. And I'm going to rinse that out, rinse everything out, and come back and style it. So it is a thicker um, conditioner, and with my hair, it takes some um, rubbing it in. And I'm trying to rub it in. I'm trying to get it on every strand. From root to tip. From root to tip. And I needed this, guys, because after I did that um, wash and go, my hair was feeling super dry. So I need this. So I'm rubbing it in, rubbing it in, down the shaft of my hair like this, squeezing it in a little bit, opening it up, make sure I'm getting all those strands. See, I see a little area in here where I can add a little more. I just want to thoroughly coat my strands okay and then I'm going to twist this back up make sure I get it on my edges because those edges need moisture too and I'm going to twist it like this Let it marinate. And so I'm going to twist it all over. I'm going to apply it throughout the rest of my hair, guys. I'm going to twist it up. I'm going to um, put on a plastic cap and sit under the dryer for about 30 minutes to let it marinate. And then I'll rinse it out and I'll come back and show you guys uh, what I'm going to do to set my hair with the moisturizing sealing lotion. 
Okay guys, I just came from under the dryer, had on a plastic cap, I had on one of my heavy scarves, I sat under there 30 minutes, and this is what my hair is looking like, it feels good, you can see that um, the deep conditioner did absorb quite a bit, it feels soft, yes, I would definitely be able to do some detangling. And after I do some detangling, I'm going to get in the shower and rinse the deep conditioner out. And I'll be back to style my hair. That's going to be uh, the last step um, with the moisture sealing lotion. So that's going to be the last step. But yeah, guys, this is what my hair is looking like. It feels really soft. So, uh, I'm feeling good about it so far. It feels really soft. All right. Okay, guys. Keep watching. Okay, guys. I'm back. I have rinsed the deep conditioner out of my hair. In the last clip, I showed you guys where I had got from under the dryer and what my hair was looking like. Um, sitting under the dryer, letting the heat, you know, hit my hair it really softened it up. I was able to do a little more finger detangling, real light, and go through it with um, a wide tooth comb. I was able to do that, go through my whole head, got in the shower, took my shower, then rinsed it out. I quickly put these twists in, so, you know, to keep it moisturized. And I did do one twist i thought i was recording and i wasn't sorry <laughs> but uh what i'm using now is the sacred moisture sealing lotion and per the instructions you can use it on uh, damp or dry hair and also uh, it says it seals in moisture leaving the hair smooth and shiny and it also says apply sparingly again on damp or dry hair so i did that for the first one and let me show you guys the consistency of this it's kind of like a, a, a leave-in consistency it's not really thick uh, it has that same uh, light um, like maybe floral perfume type fragrance real faint real faint so if you are sensitive to strong uh, aromas or scents you won't have a problem with this so this is what it looks like it's like really creamy really really creamy like a really creamy leave-in so I'm gonna do this one and instead of doing my regular like you know what eight eight to nine jumbo twist I'm gonna do a little smaller twist so instead of this usually being one it's gonna be two okay so I'm rubbing that in and I'm gonna rub a little more because it says sparingly so I don't want to you know get too heavy handed with it that in. Rub it in, rub it in. I'm going to use the wide tooth comb one more time. Okay. And I got a little more here. Get that off. A little more here. Add on the ends. And then I'm going to this up and I'm going to twist firmly like I always do and at the end I'm just going to twirl it to have a little curl on the end okay. 
so far I'm, I'm liking the products I am liking them the scent is nice a nice scent not too overwhelming the products uh, they've gone on smooth like I said um, that shampoo really went on smooth and then uh, the deep conditioner it had a, a more of a, a thicker uh, consistency which I like in my deep conditioner but when I got under uh, the dryer um, you can see where uh, it had absorbed into my hair making it soft I'm twirling it So guys, what I'm going to do, it is late. I'm going to finish up uh, twisting my hair off camera and I'll be back to show you guys what my hair is looking like. Okay guys, it's late. I have finished twisting my hair. I came back on so I can show you guys what my twists are looking like uh, using the sacred moist moisture sealing lotion so they looking kind of juicy we're gonna see you know what it looks like um i'm gonna try my best guys to come back tomorrow it just depends if my hair is totally dry if it is i would definitely be back and we're gonna wrap this up so um just keep Hey guys, I'm back. It's the next day. I let my twist dry overnight. You guys know I use the Beyonce's Sacred product line. I use the shampoo, the deep conditioner, and the moisturizing sealing cream to do my hair. I use the sealing cream to set my twist. And I put them up like this so I can get a little more stretch. They were a little shrunken. Guys, they feel so soft. So soft. But what I'm getting ready to do now is I'm going to unravel them. And I want to show you guys how they look so you guys can see it with me. This first one. Okay. Looks pretty defined. Okay, so that's good. I mean, it feels so, so soft. And, you know, we all want, you know, that definition and hold. But what is really important also is how your hair feels and performs, that it's springy. It feels moisturized. Let me take another one down. Let me end up taking all these down. Um, that is springy. It's moisturized. It has a, a nice shine to it. Yeah, it feels good. It feels good. It feels moisturized. It doesn't feel dry at all. So, uh, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish taking down the twist and because I'm not trying to make this video super super long I'm going to finish taking down the twist and I'm going to fluff it a bit and I'm going to come back show you you know my final results and I'm going to share my thoughts on these products be right back okay guys I am back I have finished unraveling and fluffing my twist this is what my hair is looking like. It is nice and fluffy. Uh, you guys can see the definition. It feels good. It feels moisturized. I am liking it. Let's try to get up so close so you guys can see it. Um, it feels great, guys. It feels great. Um, I see a little sheen. I did not use any oil at all. Um, I just want to use, you know, the products that I ordered. I didn't want to add anything to it. I did not uh, use any heat. So this is what my hair is looking like. Just 
unraveling the twist um i like it i think it looks cute it's fluffy uh got you know some definition in there you know we got a little frizz going on too but you guys know i like that because i like the dimension that it gives but um the product that i use to set the twist the moisture sealing lotion it says it is a light hold and it is it but it feels so good oh, it feels so good so what i want to do now guys i kind of want to give you a summary of what all i used i ordered three products from beyonce's new sacred line the per first product that i used uh, was the hydrating shampoo i had previously had my hair in a wash and go and for that wash and go i had used mousse and gel to set it so it was very dry by the time i was ready to shampoo my hair it was very dry i'm talking bone dry and so i used the sacred shampoo uh after you know running the water and you know hydrating my hair well before you know applying the shampoo guys know that's something that i stress that you do let the water run and penetrate your hair first but i followed it with this and guys it lathered up right away i did not have to you know kind of work the lather it lathered up right away nice silky feeling lather the scent is nice um and i shampooed my hair twice and rinsed it and uh, it was nice um got my hair thoroughly clean from the gunk from the wash and go that i had and it still felt moisturized it it you know how sometimes you know you can use shampoo and it's just squeaky squeaky clean you know which you want it clean but you know sometimes it feels a little rough did not have that rough feeling uh definitely felt you know like it was uh, moisturized so after the shampoo i went on to the deep conditioner and this is what it looks like guys it's it's quite creamy but it does have a thickness to it which i like i like a thicker uh deep conditioner and um so after i shampooed i had my hair in sections and i applied the deep conditioner and you guys saw that clip and you know when i applied it i made sure i thoroughly applied it and rubbed it in although it was kind of sitting on top of my hair i followed the instructions i sat under heat my hooded dryer uh, had a plastic cap on my head and it says you don't have to sit no more than 30 minutes and that's exactly what i did and you guys saw you know how uh, the product had absorbed into my hair and my hair felt so soft i was able to do uh, my detangling i do a little finger detangling pulling my hair apart and then after i do that i run through my hair with the wide tooth comb and i had no problem doing that after using this so i like this i like this so far these two i like and i give thumbs up to so after i had did the whole deep conditioning process uh, it was time for me to set my twist out and that's when i grabbed the sacred uh, moisture sealing lotion and uh, per the instructions you apply this sparingly uh, to the hair and um and it is a light hold so i did that i rubbed that through through my hair and i twisted it up i had maybe about 16 twists and i tied my hair up in my scarf and went to bed and it also um uh recommends that you uh, apply it to damp or dry hair so that's what it says so i did that and you know this is like the end of the day you know where i'm unraveling and fluffing and these are my results again uh, my hair feels good it feels moisturized i'm liking it guys i'm liking it trying to get up a little closer so you guys can uh, get a good look I, I love this look and what else uh they have a nourishing hair oil which i almost got i kind of wish i had got it um uh, because you know i've 
kind of old school. <laughs> uh, sometimes, sometimes I'm old school when doing my hair, and sometimes with uh, twist styles where I'm using some kind of cream. I might put a little oil on my hand and run that down that section before I twist it up. The what LCO method, I think, you know, and that's, you know, kind of like, you know, what I used to do. And I, I still do it from time to time. To me, it might add maybe a little more hold, a little more shine, you know, so, um, but I didn't, I didn't use oil, you know, this time I just used these products because I, I want to see what these products could do and um this is what i got my hair feels great i am really uh pleased with it i still might you know get that oil still on the fence about that but um these products i you know am uh i'm, I'm happy with the results that i got i really am and something else about them uh, I like the packaging, you know, I think it's cute. I think it's really cute and unique. And also, uh, the fragrance is really nice. Like I was smelling my scarf cause it, and I had just washed my scarf. So it was, you know, totally fresh didn't have any other sense. I was just, oh, it smells so good. So, um, I like the fragrance too. So, uh, um, one more thing I wanted to mention, I mentioned it earlier that I did, you know, have the opportunity to, uh, see an interview with, um, uh, Tina Knowles that she did with, uh, I think it was a lure.com or probably associated with a lure magazine and where she was, you know, uh, talking about, you know, uh, the line, how, you know, important it was to them uh for you know to have the right product she said you know uh beyonce was really you know like serious about the testing the ingredients and all that you know they they really really wanted you know to get this right as far as the ingredients and making sure it was thoroughly tested on you know, it's supposed to be for you know all types of hair and um uh, but one thing she said um that really impressed me and she was talking you know about you know you could tell she had her knowledge um she mentioned you know how important to her it was to um uh help people to become more knowledgeable about their hair and how to manage their hair and that is a passion of mine um uh, some of you may know that I am currently in cosmetology school and the cosmetology school that I go to that is the focus natural hair uh, health and beauty you know that is you know one of the main focuses of our school and um, one thing that's very important to me you know as I see clients in our student salon is to educate people about hair encouraging them to get to know their hair encouraging them to learn how to manage you know their hair so when she said that you know I was like oh, okay Tina <laughs> okay Miss Knowles uh, so uh, I was really impressed with that and I just think um, Beyonce and her mom Tina, I, I think they did a good job on this, uh, on this line as far as the initial, you know, uh, results that I got. So you know, those are my thoughts um, and how I uh, feel about it. And uh, yeah, uh, on my initial uh, trying out of these products, I am impressed and I am happy with my results. And uh, that's it, guys. That's it for this video. I thank you for watching. I thank you for following me along in this process of um, uh, these sacred products. And I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and share it with someone else who you feel will enjoy the information. And come back to see me. <laughs> Hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. That way you'll know when I drop a new video. Until the next one. Peace.